All right. It appears that I've left myself in, some, in kind of an, uh, an odd place. I don't have much in regards to weaponry left. I have no memory. So I've got no bullets for my assault rifle. I've got some crossbow bolts. I've got only four missiles. Only two grenades. 60 rounds for the flamethrower, but that could be used for that as well. Um, and then I've got the sigil. So I've placed myself in a bit of a predicament. Now, in theory, I could run back to town and try to resupply, but I've got no money. Actually, I'm gonna cut right back. I'm gonna see if I can actually head back to town. All right, so I, I've found the chalice again, because I think I lost the chalice to the governor earlier. All right, I guess that's progress of some sort. All right. Okay, so this is kind of turning out to be a bit of a resupply run, as I've already gotten, I guess I've only gotten 10 bullets, so that's not too many bullets. But I've already picked up a couple health packs. In theory, I'll be able to return to the last level of the game, at the very least, somewhat uh, resupplied. Instead of having nothing, I might have something. Or perhaps even the illusion of something. Because sometimes even the illusion of something is better than nothing. You know, this game is interesting in regards to which enemies actually fight you, and which enemies just don't care. Like, he's just minding his own business. Like, I could try to use the ammo to kill him, but like, at that point, is it worth it? Also, I probably should find out what this one, what this gun does again. That was pretty awesome. How much ammo did it actually use? It used 30 bullets. How is it different from the regular version? It uses 20 bullets, and it does less damage. Okay, so if I want to kill him, I could just use that, but there's a bit of a charge time. And it takes away health. Or maybe it's because it just takes so long for uh, the actual shot to get out. All right. You can continue on, soldier. Oh. And because I did the whole jumping thing, these platforms just raise themselves. How convenient. Okay, I found a... another separate level? Unrelated to the final level? And it has its own bad guys. Looks like these guys already do not like me. I do not know why. Perhaps it's because of my whole rebellion thing. And killing of all of their bosses. Alright. But it looks like, at the very least, I should be able to... Get some supplies, especially some armor. You can see some armor there. Ah! <laughs> nope. Don't hide against a wall. Uh... How am I going to negotiate this? Just step forward. You can do it. Or step away. That's very rude of that guy. Alright, I might as well take care of this guy while I've got range. Ah! 
Excellent. Used up a bunch of missiles, but that is A-OK. -okay. Also, I've got a whole bunch of these poison arrows. So, these regular soldier dudes... Uh, ain't got nothing on me. Also, there are spider bots again. I do not miss... The, uh, spider bot. There you go. Okay. And I probably should pick this up real quick, like... Now I have armor again. Excellent. Hmm. Nope. Oh, hello. Nope. And you are dead, and I can get some more missiles, but there's, of course, more spider bots. And they're gonna drop down. Let's see if I can get uh, the spider bot to walk by this thing, and then I can blow it up. Walk by... Hmm. And who's shooting at me? I bet it's bad guys. Bad guys with guns. They're probably shooting at me. Fantastic. Alright. So basically, what I'm trying to do now is collect ammo, shoot guys, and then live. Try to kind of reduce the losses, so to speak. Because I need to return to that main section of the game in better condition than when I left it. Because otherwise there's no point in me, be, uh, in me being here. Also, armor. And hello. Does this guy have anything to s Who shot at me? Is there like an invisible guy hanging around here somewhere? Also, I probably should deal with these spiders. can still hear spiders out there. They're not next to me. Talk to Master Smithy if you have any questions. All I do is put labels on the crates. See you later! Man, there's leather armor there too. Alright. I've got armor, I got health kits, I got some ammo. Everything's coming up Millhouse. You know, I was I was worried about coming back to this game. One, knowing which save file I actually last used, and two You son of a And two um, will I actually be able to proceed and survive? But now that I've got a whole bunch of health kits, and I've got some ammo, the odds are ever increasing in my favor. Although I hear these, these spider bots are one of the most... Ah, son of a... Annoying enemies in the game. Who shot? Oh, you dare shoot at me. Ah! Everybody's shooting at me. So take... Yeah, I hear you up there. St 
stirring things up. Uh, let's switch to flamethrower for these guys. Because even though the flames look absolutely awful, ah, uh, there. It is a very effective. Uh, let's see how well this works. Hmm. Not so great. Better. Um, let's use up a couple of those. And, oh, hello. Ah, hello. I don't know why I ran from them. They're like the weakest enemies in the game. I'm guessing that's radioactive or something? That's why it's the green light? Or the last environmental suit I used uh, finally expired. That's one issue with the game, is that for the environmental suits and such, it's really hard to tell when... Um, ooh. What did that do? Where did that go? Hmm. Also, can I... Nope. <laughs> That's the nice thing about old-school design. They'll literally have a dumb sound file of the character telling you he cannot do a thing. Just, nope. Oh, what's going on here? Oh, hello. Let's see if I can make use of this. I don't know. Okay, so this always uses health. Okay. And I got some more armor. And... I'm guessing there's some items up here. And then there's this guy. Is this guy the, the, the smith? Master Smithy. I run this place. My job is to build the raw parts needed for the lore master's robot designs. If you're not here on official business, then I'm afraid I don't have time to talk. Well, it's a good thing I'm on official business. I see no proof of that. That son of a... Okay. Maybe there's proof I can find of my official business that I definitely have here. Hmm. I didn't realize there would be this entire level to go through, but hey, it's good. Because there's items galore. And there's a portal for me to go into, and what does... Eh. Not very important, but hey. It's there. Uh, eh. uh. Ooh. Okay. That is a very awkward staircase to have, just in the middle of nowhere. Hmm. Nope. What are you telling me, nope? I know you can use that. So I'm gonna eventually have to hop into these portals to see where they go. 
Uh, let's see, where does this go? Okay, this is the bottom of that staircase, so... Okay, so that literally just goes there. Anything I missed in this area? Yes. There is an area on the bottom right corner of the map. That goes nowhere. Yep. Huh. Now where does this go? Yeah, more health. Very useful. Ooh, big health. Interesting, but the only way to get it is from the other side, it looks like. It's been so long, I don't even remember if there is a crouch button in this game. I don't think there is. Because then I would just be able to kind of go down there. Okay, maybe I can hop into the portal backwards and return to this location. The answer is no. Oh! This is gone. Where did it go? What did stepping on that platform reveal? Did it clear up this elevator over here? No, it did not. It did nothing. Okay, so I've explored this whole level. Um, I am going to take a quick... I'm just gonna, just gonna kill Mr. Smithy, see what he drops. Out of curiosity. Does he drop anything? Is he invincible? Does he react to any damages? Okay. He is invincible. Okay. Alright, uh, so it looks like I've explored this area, area to capacity, which is good because now I've got 12 medium health kits, I got two large ones, I got two combat armor, two leather armor, in and I got the offering chalice back for some reason, because why the hell not? See, it's convenient that everybody you've killed stays dead. Especially since you're able to explore the world in such a large fashion. Ooh, it looks like I missed something on the left there. Maybe. Um, like if I had to deal with people respawning, that would be a huge pain in the ass. Alright, it looks like I see a part in the bottom there that I might not have explored fully. So I will try to find where on earth that is. And I'll just cut to where to, uh, whether or not it's interesting or not. I guess if it's not interesting, I'm not gonna cut to it. Ah! Okay, it's more interesting than I expected. Also, is this supposed to be an invisible wall? Wow. Okay, now I've got a ton of assault gun ammo and flamethrower rounds. I'm low on crossbow bolts, but... Oh, hello. Who cares about crossbow bolts? They are the weakest link. Oh, hello. I mean, sure, it's how I started my adventure. It wouldn't have uh, progressed far if I did not have the crossbow. Such a long 
long time ago. Where am I? What does this do? Hmm. That did something somewhere with someone. I presume. You know, I probably shouldn't save my game unless I realize that something had happened. If nothing had happened, then I could always... Okay, so that's already done. I can always go back on it. Hmm. It looks like there's an opening on the bottom left there. I will check it out. Cut to that. Okay. We've got a... It looks like we got a switch of some... Nope, that does nothing. We got three portals. That goes here. No reason to care. That goes here. Okay, um, that goes, okay, that goes back to where, uh, I need to be. And then... Hmm. Okay. Alright, so, I've kind of dicked around for a little while. I'm going to give an attempt at forward progress. It's probably going to take me a couple seconds to actually get to where I need to be. <laughs> wow. So, I'm just going to cut to uh, me arriving in the following level. You know, it's been so long, I don't even remember why I came here. And there are spider bots, of course. Oh my gosh. I am sick of this mystical double talk. Okay. So this is where things go to crazy town. Okay, so I'm going to, hopefully, I'm going to kill this spider bot. Okay. Okay. I'm just going to cut to the point where I somehow get past that first line of dialogue. Um and kind of end up in a position where it's comfortable. Okay, so I've gotten a couple guys. Let's uh, heal up a little bit. Eventually I'm gonna have to step out and deal with this spider bot. Okay, that is done. There are a couple turrets. Uh, one to the right of me, one to the left of me. Um, I believe missiles might be the best. How many shots? It takes three shots to take out one of these. Alright. I am sick of this mystical double talk. Alright, now I am past the mystical double talk. Hello, goodbye. So now I've got this guy to take care of. In theory, the flamethrower will be enough. Oh, hello. Okay, they explode way more than I expected. 
Let's see how well the sigil works against these guys. The sigil works terribly against these guys. So what I can do is I've got some of the grenade launcher ammo, which is pretty tough. Okay, I don't know how effective any of that was, so... Apparently I have to go to the center of the map. There's another turret in this direction, so I probably should get rid of it. Excellent. And these guys should be nice and easy. And it, those giant jetpack guys are probably way back on the other side. Okay. What on earth is this? What on... <laughs> you know oh okay this is his robot army that he's building wow you know I forgot how graphic this game got I played this as a kid, too. Yeesh. Also, I forget what my maximum health is, so let's... Okay, so 190 is the max. Mm. I, notice how they're all in, like, different states of, uh... Of physical well-being. Ooh. Alright. Now, there are the two giant jetpack guys. Those are the only guys I really need to worry about right now. And there's also this switch here. I don't know what it does... Let's find out. Should I be worried? Oh, hello. I'm going to... I'm going to save this as a... Wizard first try. Because I've still got the jetpack guys running amok. Where the hell did you go? Hmm. You know, I assume that only the... Actually, I assume that only the sigil would damage him, but he's not in his swamp gas form. So... Okay, so that's like a weird hookshot thing. Come, expose yourself to me. Your would-be murderer. Who is very scary when he's not trying to be hit by anything else. Ah, there you are. Hello. Hmm. Let's switch sides, because you're over there now. Okay. Actually, 
Do I need to actually kill him? Let's find out. The answer is probably yes. But I'm gonna do a little bit, okay, so I probably kill him in order to gain access to that. Nope, wrong. Actually, what happens to those uh, giant jetpack guys? Where do they go? Are they way down there? What are they doing down there? All right, I might as well just try to try to beat this guy. So we'll give wizard first try. Um, hmm. Let's try using missiles. That sounds like they'd be they it sounds like they'd be damaging, but I already know from practice That they're not. And actually, I'll go check up and see if, uh, yep. Are these like an unlimited amount of guys just spawning there? Okay, let's head back, see if we can take this guy. Oh, there you are. Hey, buddy. Where did he go? Hello. Hmm. Oh. Actually. And there he goes. Oh no. What killed me? What killed me? Where is he now? Oh, hello. Hmm. Okay, so that doesn't work. Let's try the... Let's try the flamethrower again. Um, well. And then run after he dies. WFT part two. Why are you hiding up there? Come back down. Ah. Got a scope. Oh, he's become a gas. He's become his swamp gas form. So now I need to break out the sigil. And then I can damage him. Nope. Okay, the problem is he's also doing a lot of damage against me. Which is not very nice of him. I probably should start saving my game when I actually do some sort of damage to him. See, like that one, complete miss. Uh, nope. So let's start heading to the other side. Hopefully I'll have, nope, have some better luck. But I've also got these other guys to deal with. 
I wonder how I'm supposed to get to this, uh... <sighs> to this elevator way over there. Or that teleport. Nope. I don't know, for some reason this angle is just not working for me. Hmm. Like, it doesn't even seem like I'm hitting him once. There's, wow. That place got crowded. Wow. Okay, so it looks like I've used... Holy crap, where did you come from? It looks like I've used up one of my metal armors. Okay, but at least that definitely hits. About time. This has been a long time in the making. I wonder, is this an infinite party? Okay, let's resupply and see where this leads me. Because this might actually, this will be actually the first time I've always seen the bad ending. The bad ending and then the mostly bad ending. That son of a... But I've never seen the good ending of the game. Ugh. And then there are those jetpack guys just mind minding their own business. They're like, you know what? We don't need to participate. You can uh you can do whatever you want over there. As long as you don't bother us and let us fire as many rockets willy nilly. Ah, oh, man. Now, I believe this drop does damage me. But I can take it. Alright. And I also believe that there's just one final screen. And this is all... Holy crap. That is a waste of a whole bunch of ammo. Um, okay. I'm gonna stop teasing myself. Let's go for it. Let's see what's on the other side. need the full sigil to unlock this puppy. Something tells me this is the end of the rainbow. Okay. All right. Alien ship.
Well, this is a boss fountain if I've seen one. I got tons of grenade rounds. I got invisibility suits. Whew. Breathe in, breathe out. Good luck to us all. Maybe I shouldn't be using uh, the sigil rounds against these ordinary foes. Okay. And of course, more spider bots. Anybody over here? No. You know, I know I must have played this when I was younger. Oh, crap. But I have no memory. Which is good, because that means everything is new to me. Ah, uh, crap. One of those guys. How well is this going to work? I don't know. But I will try it anyway. Ah, damn. I forget this guy just explodes all over the place. Alright. And just start unleashing. Okay. Son of a... Okay. So I went from 135 to nothing. Okay. He is dead. What are those? Are they nothing? Let's see what I pass by. Or this is not something I passed by. Hmm. This is something else. Ah, uh, okay, yeah, that's something else. Was there another... How do I... Okay, I'm just gonna cut to whenever I somehow manage to climb back down this elevator. Okay, so I got to the bottom of the elevator. What have we got here? 
Um, the Entity's Lair. Huh. All right. Let's give it a go. <sighs> this is stressful. Like, I remember this game as being hard, but... Like, this uh, this game, I would argue, is much more difficult than Doom. Like, y there are certain challenge, like, certain individual challenges, but... Alright. It's also interesting that you've got all these, uh... Very unique... Okay, let's, um... Entity. That missed. Is there a way up from here? No, only a way down. Yep. Smoke monster. Let's see how well this goes. Get. Mm. There we go. Mm. Alright. So it's going to be difficult. I'm going to have... Th this is especially a little bit trickier. Because I the only way to hit him is with a... Weapon that will damage me. Um, okay, let's save in this one. That way I can always return to... To the safe. Oh, he has divided. He hopes to divide and conquer, but I assure you, you will only divide and lose. Nothing inspires reward sex like defeating an alien entity and... Uh, this was the 90s. This was like when James Bond was... Uh. Okay.
3D engine licensed from id software. Hmm. Okay. Now I can sit back. I can relax. I can breathe. I saved the day. Saved the woman who kind of looked a little bit like, um... Like, uh... What's her face? Jean Grey as a uh, phoenix. And now, it is done. Thank you for watching. Questions, comments, recommendations for something to play next? Comment down below or send it on over to it sounded good on paper at gmail.com. That's it sounded good on paper at gmail.com. So long for now.